Kumusta kayo mga kids? Ating simulan ang week 1, lesson 1 of 3 ng ating grade 4, quarter 2 mathematics. Ang ating topic ngayon, identifying the multiples and factors of a given number up to 100. Halina kayo, samahan niya ako sa video ito. Tayo matuto. Getting a multiple of a number is look like skip counting with the same number. Multiple of a number are the same numbers that are added repeatedly. Example, the multiples of 2 are 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. As you can see, it's look like is keep counting by twos or repeating in adding by twos. You can also easily get the multiples of a certain number by multiplying the number by another whole number. For example, you can get the multiples of 3 by multiplying 3 by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and so on. Therefore, the multiples of 3 are 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, and so on. Factors are the numbers that when you multiply can give a larger number or a product. In every number, it has at least two factors. The number itself and 1. However, some numbers have more than 2 factors, like 12. The factors of 12 are 1 and 12, 2 and 6, and 3 and 4. Therefore, if you ask to list the factors of 12, you would write 1, 2, 3, 4, and 6. Both multiples and factors are significant and prerequisite lesson before expanding and reducing fractions in lowest term and finding the patterns in a number. Therefore, this lesson will help you for your future lesson. This time, focus your attention on how to identify the factors and multiples of a given number up to 100. Multiples Look at the model blocks below. Try to analyze how you can get the multiples of 4. When you multiply 4 by 1, 2, 3, and 4, you can get multiples of this number. 1 times 4 equals 4. 2 times 4 equals 8. 3 times 4 equals 12, 4 times 4 equals 16. Therefore, the multiples of 4 are 4, 8, 12, 16, and so on. How about 5? Can you tell at least 10 multiples of this number? The multiples of 5 are... 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. You will notice that this lesson is not new to you since you have already learned how to skip counting from your previous grades. Now, you may proceed with your next topic. Factors 
How about identifying the factors of a number 4? Look at this example. 4. When you multiply 1 times 4, the answer is 4. Another. When you multiply 2 times 2, equals 4. When you express number 4 as a product of 2 or more numbers, each of this counting number 1, 2, and 4 are factors of 4. You will notice that the number itself can be one of its factors. How about identifying the factors of a number like 16? Isip nga kayo ng number pag multiply 16? Yes, 1 times 16. Meron pa ba? Pag multiply ang sagot ay 16. 2 times 8. Meron pa ba? 4 times 4. In this example, you will notice that number 16 has 2 or more factors. These are 1, 2, 4, and 16 or the number itself. Now that you already know how to identify the multiples and factors of a given number, try to do the following learning task below. Learning task 1. Identify the multiples of the following number inside the box. Write your answer on your notebook. For number 1, what is the multiple of 7? Let's skip counting by 7, 7, 14, 21, and so on. So the answer is 7. How about number 2? Skip counting by 9, 9, 18, 27. So, the answer is 9. Para sa learning task 2, select the factors of the following number. Write your answer in your notebook. Sagutan natin ang number 1. Ano ba ang factors ng 9? Sulat natin lahat ng factors ng 9. Isip tayo ng number o numbers pag multiply, the answer is 9. Una, 1 in itself o 1 times 9. At meron ding 3 times 3. So, ang factors ng 9 ay 1, 3, and 9. Sagutan naman natin ang number 2. Anong factors ng 20? Isulat natin ang mga factors ng 20. Una, 1 and itself or 1 times 20. Meron ding 2 times 10 and 4 times 5. So, ang factors ng 20 ay 1, 2, 4, 5, 10, and 20. Let us answer number 6. What are the factors of 18? Factors of 18 are 1 and itself. Or 1 and 18. Meron ding 2 times 9. And 3 times 6. So the factors of 18 are 1, 2, 9, and 18. For number 7, what are the factors of 56? 
factors of 56 i 1 in itself or 1 times 56 2 times 28 pwede rin ang 4 times 14 and 7 times 8 kaya naman ang factors ng mga nasa pagpipilian ay ang 1 2 7 8 28 and 56 Para sa learning task 3, write the first 6 multiples of each number in your notebook. For number 7, 7, 14, 21, 28, 35, and 42. For item number 2, 6, Skip counting by 6, 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, and 36. For learning task 4, write the factors of each number in your notebook. For item number 1, 20. Factors of 20, 1 times 20, 2 times 10, 4 times 5. So the factors of 20 are 1, 2, 4, 5, 10, and 20. For learning task 4, number 2. 24. What are the factors of 24? Factors of 24. 1 times 24. 2 times 12. 3 times 8. And 4 times 6. So the factors of 24 are 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 8, 12, and 24. For learning task 5, identify what is asked in its item below. Write your answer in your notebook. For item number 1, what number I am if I am between 21 and 31? A multiple of 4 and 7. Para makuha ang sagot, isulat ang multiples ng 4 and 7. Para sa multiples of 4 and multiples of 7. Then, kunin natin ang LCM ng 4 and 7. At yan ay 28. Ang 28 ba ay between 21 and 31? Yes. Kaya naman ang sagot natin ay 28. For item number 2, what number I am if I am a factor of 70 and I am between 30 to 40? Sulat natin ang factors ng 70. Ano ba ang mga numbers na pag multiply ang sagot ay 70? Una, 1 times 70. Pwede rin na ang 2 times 35. 5 and 14. And 7 and 10. Alin dito ang between 30 to 40 sa mga factors? 35. Kaya ang sagot natin dito ay 35. We can find multiple of a given number by multiplying the number by another whole number other than 0. When you express a number as a product of two or more counting numbers, then each of these counting numbers is a factor of the given number. For learning task 6, write the letter of the correct answer, write your answer in your notebook. For item number 1, which of the following is a factor of 96? 
A24 and 4, B12 and 8, C2 and 48, D all of the above. Ang 24 and 4 ba ay factors ng 96? Yes. Ang 12 and 8 factors din ba ng 96? Oo. Ang 2 and 48 factors din ba ng 96? Yes. Kaya naman ang sagot natin ay all of the above. For item number 2, which of the following is not a multiple of 12? Isulat natin ang mga multiples of 12. Ang 24 ay multiple of 12. Ganon din ang 48 at ang 96. Kaya ang sagot natin ay 73. 73 is not a multiple of 12. Maraming salamat sa inyong pananood. Pwede kayo mag-like, mag-comment, at i-share ang ating mga videos. Huwag kalimutan mag-subscribe at pindutin ang notification bell para updated kayo para sa ating mga bagong videos. Hanggang sa muli, paalam!